Hi and welcome to the Engage Partner News from your Acumatica News team. I'm Richard Duffy. I am the Vice President of Partner Strategy and Enablement and Product Evangelist and this is... I'm Charlie Horton and I am the Partner Development Manager here at Acumatica. Do you know what you do? No, sometimes I forget because we do so much here at Acumatica. Yeah, absolutely. And so because we do so much, there's a lot of news that we want to cover with you today. So let's get started. First things first, you probably realise and maybe you don't realize, uh, and if you don't realize, you should realize that very, very recently Acumatica took what we've been doing with the Acumatica Cloud Framework and we listened to what the market was telling us and we really relaunched that as the Acumatica XRP Cloud Framework. Now this is a platform on which developers can build full business applications and it's basically the platform which Acumatica built first and then we built our own ERP on top of that and that's the platform that our partners like Jazz, like uh, MYOB, Visma, um, Housing System Solutions, a whole range of these organizations are building their solutions on top of as well. So we've taken that and we've launched that and I'd encourage you to take a look at the information that you can find on the Acumatica portal about that. Now what we've also done hand in hand with that is we've launched the Acumatica Developer Network. And you can find the Acumatica Developer Network, funnily enough, at adn.acumatica.com. Now watch out for your spelling checker. Every time I type ADN, uh, the computer thinks it's smarter than I am and tries to change it to A-N-D. So if it doesn't work, uh, you, if you get a, pay, a page not found error, just make sure you haven't been spell checked into and.acumatica.com. Okay, so it's A, that's A for Apple, pardon my atrocious accent, D for developer, N for network. So adn.acumatica.com. It's where we're really trying to build a whole new community of developers. There are forums there, very light on content right now, but we're asking you to help us change that. Ask your questions about working with Acumatica um, as a developer's platform. Uh, get on there and ask those questions and we'll, uh, together, we'll build that content. All right, so that's the XRP Cloud Platform and the Acumatica Developer Network, or ADN. This week is a three-letter acronym week at Acumatica. So we've got two new ones there for you. Uh, Charlie, what have you got uh, that you want to tell us about? Yep, as we know, uh, in July we have two of our competitor events coming up. That is the Worldwide Partner Conference put on by Microsoft and the Sage Conference uh, put on by Sage. Uh, and we will be attending both. Next week, Christian Lindbergh, our VP of ISVs, will be at the Worldwide Partner Conference. So if you're attending, shoot him an email. He'd love to stop by, meet you for coffee, say hello. Uh, and then at the Sage Conference, which is in Las Vegas in a couple of weeks out, we will actually have an Acumatica coffee stand going. This Acumatica coffee stand will be right outside the border grill, uh, directly across from the main entrance. So stop by, get a cup of good Acumatica coffee, say hello to Don Yeager, who will be representing us there, uh, and have a great conference. Fantastic, thank you. Uh, next thing I want to talk to you about is uh, a new service that we've put together for you. Uh, I have a bunch of servers that are sitting in Australia in a huge data center right next to all of Amazon's uh, servers. And I put up a copy of Acumatica which you can access and use in your demonstrations. If you want to point somebody to a version of Acumatica that they can just have a little bit of a play with just to see how it works and so on and so forth, then I would encourage you to go and, uh, and visit that, that demo server. Now you can find it at www.smecloudrp.com slash Acumatica. And you'll see that the login credentials are there on the very first splash screen where you log in. Uh, you log in as admin and one, two, three. And please note the, uh, the, the comments that are there on that splash screen. We wipe out and refresh the demo data on that server every Sunday night at midnight. Or if somebody's gone in during the week and done something really atrocious, then I'll go and I'll refresh the data using the snapshot functionality that you know is built into Acumatica. So that's there for you. Uh, in that infrastructure, there's something like 20 available CPU cores, uh, and I think it's in excess of about 512 gigabytes of RAM across uh, a couple of different servers. So uh, running virtualization. If you would like me to set up a demo environment for you on that, I'm more than happy to do so as well. Just reach out to me, rduffy at acumatica.com. I'll be more than happy to, uh, to set it up for you. All right. 
Um, by now, we expect that all of you have already registered for our Partner Summit coming up uh, the last week of August in Denver, Colorado at the Omni Interlochen. But for those of you who haven't yet, for those of you who are new partners, there is still space available, though it is limited, and classes are filling up for the training in the last three days. So make sure you go register. You get to meet the whole Acumatica team, meet other partners, our ISV solutions, and it'll be a fantastic week. So you can register at acumatica.com forward slash summit. Also, if you've registered but you haven't booked your hotel yet at the Omni Interlochen, make sure to also go book your hotel uh, as space is limited in the hotel. We want to make sure you have the easiest walk straight down the elevator right into the ballroom for all the key sessions. And if you don't book your hotel room, don't come to me looking for a place to sleep um, because my room will already be full of uh, all kinds of junk, so there'll be no place for you to sleep. Um, all right, speaking of uh, all things uh, busy and junk and things that aren't junk, uh, the Demo University. Every Friday at 11? Mm -hmm. uh, every Friday at 11, I, I deliver it and I don't even know what time it's on. Um, every Friday at 11 a.m. Pacific Standard Time, I run the Demo University. And this is an opportunity for you as a partner to come along and learn about demonstration and sales best practices. Uh, and to also come along and have the opportunity to practice your skills in a low risk, in a friendly environment. Now also, in order for you to get your sales engineer badge, one of the things you have to do is you have to do a mock demo of Acumatica. If you come along to the Demo University, we do, we have one available slot each week for a partner to come and do a presentation. If you wanna come along and do your mock demo presentation at the Demo University, not only will you learn something new, but you'll also um, achieve that uh, requirement to get your sales engineer badge. So I'd invite you to come along to that. Now we've done three so far. All of those replays are up on the Acumatica Partner Portal. Um, thanks to Charlie, he's put those up almost immediately after they're, uh, they're done. So you can go and access the previous ones. If you're thinking, mm, is this something I wanna go and take a look at? Is there value? Uh, we'll let you be the judge. Feedback so far has been very, very good. But go and take a look at those replays and, uh, and come along. There's a link there where you can go and register for the rest of the sessions. For those of you who already registered, we are updating uh, the platform. We're gonna move to GoToTraining uh, and we're gonna send out a new invitation for you so that you can just simply click on the one acceptance via the Outlook invitation. It will set itself up as a recurring meeting for you in your Outlook or iCal if you're using a Mac. Um, and then, you know, every week when you come along, it'll just ask you to quickly pop in your, uh, your registration details and join the session. So that's the Demo University. Any feedback you've got on it as well, of course, and on anything that any of us are doing at Acumatica, uh, we'd love to hear from you. And you can either contact me, rduffy, at acumatica.com or reach out to Charlie at chorton at acumatica.com and we'd love, to, uh, we'd love to help you out with that. Charlie. Yep. Over the last five months or so, we've been running our ISV webinar series. It's been a great chance for all of the Acumatic ISVs to do webinars to you, the partners, on what is the product that they have, how do you sell it, how does a partner, you the partners, engage with an ISV when you have a prospective customer. All of these webinar recordings are now up in the partner portal. So if you missed any of them or you have some questions on how do I engage with them, what is the product, what is the pricing for it, make sure to go in the partner portal under the educa education section <laughs> and you can watch all the recordings again uh, and get up to date with all the current ISV solutions we have uh, for Acumatica. Okay, what section was that again? That's the education, education <laughs> section. Gotcha. We're going to have to cut uh, that one up. No, no, <laughs> we'll keep going. Poor Charlie's suffering from a little bit of Seattle springitis. There's a lot of, uh, lot of stuff floating around that's given him a bit of a bit of a sniffle today. I thought it might have been something. No, anyway, we won't go there. But um, all right, so the next topic that I wanted to cover off with you is the new company PowerPoint and positioning deck. So uh, we've talked about this before. It's up on the partner portal. I know a lot of you don't get necessarily a chance to look at that every week, but I strongly encourage you to do so. We've produced a brand new company uh, positioning presentation. And we have also produced a whole new set of positioning documents for you to use. So I would encourage you to go and check those out. Charlie's built uh, a special area. 
uh, or he's in the process of building rather a special area on the partner portal where we're putting all of that content. You can find it on the partner portal today, um, but he's gonna put it into its own dedicated area. And I'm gonna take a couple of cut pieces from one of our uh, demo university sessions and I'm gonna record some new content showing you how to utilize that effectively. So I'd encourage you to go and take a look at that now. Uh, you're gonna find it's very, very helpful in helping you understand how to effectively explain what Acumatica is, what the Acumatic product does, what the problem is that it's built to solve and how it's gonna help uh, your customers unlock their business potential. Uh, the next thing, um, leading on from that, I actually use that presentation as the, uh, as the foundation for a weekly introduction to Acumatica webinar that I'm doing every Wednesday at 10 a.m. PST. So you can send people along to that uh, introductory webinar. Uh, it's very generic. We just talk about you know who Acumatica is, what the Acumatica product does the positioning of the Acumatica product, what do you need to look at, why cloud ERP is important, and then I give around about a 20 to 25 minute uh, quick sex and sizzle demonstration, if you like, of, of the Acumatica cloud ERP solution. Um, I don't talk about partners other than to explain to people who are watching how important partners are to our ecosystem uh, and how our product is sold 100% by and through partners. So as a partner, you can feel uh, comfortable that you, know, you send your potential customers to watch that, and then we're not gonna introduce them to a different partner. The only thing I would say to you is, uh, I do see all the people who register for that, so please make sure you do have registered your uh, potential customers in CRM, just in case they do reach out, out to us afterwards, uh, we wanna make sure we, we refer them back to you. So important to register your customers in CRM or your prospective customers in CRM. Um, again, you can find the links for that on the partner portal uh, in the webinars, the customer webinars area. And if you're not sure, if you're thinking, mm, do I wanna send somebody along to one of these things? If you haven't been to one yourself, you can watch a replay of the most recent one, which was done earlier this week, uh, which wasn't too bad if I don't say so myself. So, Charlie, what have you, uh, what have you got now? And Richard, you are, we have this new company PowerPoint that we're doing it on. Yep. We also have a nice new set of demo data that you've been using for these presentations as well, right? That's a very good point. Thank you for reminding me of that uh, without slapping me across the back of the head and saying, hey, you forgot to talk about this. So the generic demonstration package, Doug Johnson, sales engineer extraordinaire, also known as Desert Doug for his dry sense of humor, um, has put together a really good um, generic demonstration data set. Now, he and Anita, many of you know Anita from our consulting and training team, they're putting together an even better demo data set, but this is an interim step. It contains dashboards, it contains PowerPoint presentations that you can use to help you walk through each of the different scenarios that you can present with Acumatica. And it's got a couple of really nice ways uh, of adapting the, um, the user interface to provide a process flow which graphically leads people through each of the steps that they need to, to run through um, to execute a business process, whether it's procure to pay or order to cash or whatever the case may be. Now the other thing, Doug's just written a blog um, explaining exactly how you can build your own as well. So I'd encourage you to take a look at that and uh, if it's not already linked to that same page, um, we'll make sure it gets we get that link up there straight away because Charlie, you may not be aware of that one. I only I only saw that got published in the last two days. So excellent. Um, so that's an additional thing. So many things to keep up with. I think we've uh, we've talked about a lot of different things today. Um, have we covered off on all of our all of our key topics? Well, I think we have one last exciting thing. Um, yes. Acumatica has been again nominated for the People's Choice Stevie Awards. Uh, as you hopefully remember, last year we won one in Best New Product and or Service, uh, so that was really good. But this year we're nominated in four categories. Those are Best New Product, Service of the Year, uh, Cloud Platform, Financial Management Software, and Most Innovative Tech Company of the Year. So what we need now from you, the partners, is your help to go uh, and vote for Acumatica online. So uh, as you'll see on the screen right now, there is the link to where you can go vote. Uh, and down below in the Partner Portal page you're looking on now is also the links directly to the pages. We ask that you guys all take a couple minutes, go to the pages, vote for Acumatica in those four categories, 
and help us win some more awards and uh, show how great Acumatica is. Okay, so if you're wondering why I've been swaying backwards and forwards, I was you know, thinking Stevie Awards. There's nothing to do with Stevie Wonder, right? Unfortunately not. No, so that's not. I just called to say I love Acumatica. But anyway, um, on that terrible note, uh, hopefully you found today's update to be uh, valuable. Again, so many things happening with Acumatica. Um, you know, we, we try and keep you updated, but really I would encourage you, keep an eye on the Acumatica Partner Portal, keep an eye on that homepage, because Charlie is keeping on top of making sure that's updated with the latest news. As well, if you're not already on social media, at least jump onto Twitter, all right, and start following the hashtag, hash Acumatica, because you'll find that that is where we announce uh, every time something like this gets done, every time we have something new, I'm usually up there pushing out some information about it and I uh, tag it with that hashtag, hash Acumatica. One more unscheduled piece of news, which I just realized, seeing as how we're talking about news, uh, one of the other things that I'm also now publishing is a daily cloud ERP news bulletin. And you can find this at news dot richardduffy.com and you can subscribe to it. It's basically a newspaper which I publish every day which pulls together news about Acumatica and all things cloud ERP related and publishes it out. Now I publish that out independently as Richard Duffy, cloud ERP evangelist, rather than doing it under the Acumatica name because it's not just about Acumatica and one of the things you'll probably find with social media, people like um, you know, that, that whole individual approach. So that's the reason why, if you're sitting there thinking, why isn't it published as Acumatica? Well, this seems to get uh, a lot more traction and I can then talk about the things that I want to talk about rather than the things that Acumatica want me to talk about. And I've already done too much of that. So with that, I think we're done. Yeah. Um, we look forward to hearing from you. Feedback, feedback, feedback. Tell us what we're doing right. Tell us what we're doing wrong. Uh, but more importantly, if we are doing something that's not quite what you expect, please give us feedback as to what you would like us to do and how you would like us to address those things. So with that, Charlie, thank you. Thank you. And we'll see you guys at the summit. See you at the summit.